What's going on with the YouTube? It's your boy 345 German. In today's video, man, we're gonna be showing y'all how much I pay for my insurance on my Dodge Challenger RT at 19 years old, man. So, y'all wanna know how much it costs to get uh, full coverage at a young age, and then what's the estimates about like how much you gotta pay each month? Make sure y'all boys like, comment, share, subscribe, and we're gonna get y'all in this video. Y'all, so when y'all trying to get y'all a Dodge Challenger RT or a Charger RT, you will need a credit card, y'all. You need credit. I keep telling people this. You need credit. Start credit as soon as possible at 18. Start it as soon as you get the chance to. And build your credit up so you can be able to get you something that you want to actually have. If you purchase some, one of these cars, you will not be able to drive off the lot without full coverage, y'all. Y'all gotta have full coverage. So, you're gonna be telling y'all how much is my full coverage for my car specifically. And like I said, this is a 2016 Dodge Challenger RT. I got y'all, it's an RT Plus actually. Not an RT, it's an RT Plus. And we're gonna be letting y'all know how much I pay for full coverage. Uh, when I got it, it was at the age of 18. So Solid. What's going on with the YouTube? It's boy three four five. Journey. Video different day, man. We back to the insurance video. So Give me y'all insurance payments on my Dodge Challenger RT, as y'all boys can see, man. So y'all want to know how much it cost me for uh, full coverage for my age range for young people that's trying to get one of these uh, trims. So we're gonna be letting y'all know how to get insurance, how much it costs, what was my first quote. And etc. So make sure our boys stick to the end, and we about to get you in this video on how much my insurance costs. So I'm gonna give y'all another walk around one more time. But this is a 2016 Dodge Challenger RT Plus, y'all. So when I got this car, y'all, um, you gotta call around and you gotta try to get insurance before you get the car because they won't let you take it off the lot without full coverage. So um, when you get in your car. Uh, I was calling around. I done called around to like five different insurance companies. And they was all trying to charge me around like 550. Um, some was like 600. Some was like 480. And all that. And I'm like, you know what? I ain't going. So I finally had called one last um, insurance company. And them boys had gave me a good price. So I settled down with them. And I'm going to say my price range is around from 350 to 400 for my full coverage. I ain't gonna tell y'all exactly how much it is, but just you know a range around from that. And then what you also wanna do is um, when you get in your insurance, you wanna make sure um, you got no bad driver record, y'all. So that go by no accidents, that go by no speeding tickets, that go by no tent tickets, that go by no reckless driving, anything on your record, y'all. Now we gonna tell y'all about the credit history and then we gonna tell y'all about how long you was supposed to have it pretty much so. Credit history play a play uh it play a part in, in your uh insurance when you're trying to get full coverage as well too. So very good way that you could uh make your insurance lower than uh normal people for my age range is you can go on an insurance plan with your parents, y'all. So if you're going on an insurance plan with your parents, it'll make it way lower than what it'll be if you were trying to go individually and then this was your first time getting full coverage on a sports car or something like that. So just keep that in mind. So if y'all want to pay a little bit lower than what I said from the 350 to 400 range, you can also try to go on an uh, insurance plan. So ask our parents, see if they're comfortable with them. you all know, doing that. And then go ahead and yeah, yeah, get on that as soon as possible. Yeah, yeah. Cause that will make a way lower for y'all to be able to afford the car. Um, like I was saying though, so y'all going on an insurance plan with y'all parents, it'll be way lower y'all. And then step number three is, of course you gotta have credit y'all. So if you don't got credit, you pretty much ain't even gonna be able to get your car because you need credit. So that should be something that y'all should already know. I don't even know if I have to tell some y'all or not, but credit is needed in this. Credit play a factor in your insurance as well too y'all. So if your insurance, I mean, not if your insurance, if your credit score is real low and shit, your credit might be, I mean, not your credit, your insurance might be real high, y'all. So put that in mind as well, y'all. So make sure all your stuff is on point. Make sure your credit on point. Make sure your uh, your driving record on point. And then make sure you call around and check different insurance uh, companies for a different quote. And this is the 2016 Challenger RT, man. And I'm about to give y'all a little warm start real quick, though. And then we're about to end this video off for y'all, boys. Give y'all another walk around real quick, man. 
I'll let y'all see my baby just one more quick little time. But we're gonna end the video here, man. So make sure y'all boys like, comment, share, subscribe. Let me know if y'all think my insurance, my age range is still a little bit too high. And then let me know if y'all got any questions in the comment section down below. I'll be answering all y'all questions on what y'all got for insurance. Uh, wise. Knife on the stick, trying to get jiggy. They had found that boy alive. All of his body parts was missing. Mm -hmm. It's time to spin. Let's go get busy. Bitch, I'm hanging out of the truck. He breaking me. Look at my racks solid. I see the grass getting long. Snakes, I'm gon' mow it. I'm gon' blow like brown. Racks on me, I'm so rich. Talk here, top of the morning. I'm in the car, got motion. Bib ain't rock, can't fall.